Sarin Sasrikal, another very warm good evening. Jumbo Sana, because my gallery staff love me saying Jumbo Sana. I'm going to say Jumbo Sana to all my viewers of Kenya, Africa, uh, Tanzania, and uh, uh, Sarianu Niga uh, Swagat to my health show every Monday at 9.40, bringing you a wide spectrum of information JDK third apni body de which galt hai aur kede mein treatments kar di hai clinic which to assist you to overcome the symptoms. Problems jade apni zindaki vich aande hai, the show bohat vadiya vadiya topics leke aani hai. Everything that helps to detox from the body because our body carries on with so much poison and jirilya cheeza kush khane apa swad le khane ya kush khane apa apni khushi vaste khane ya kush khane apa gami de vich khane ya kush khane apa khane in social behaviors de vich kush khane apa yaar dostan nal baith ke chak chak tu vi khala chak chak tu vi peela and you know what i mean is the yellow water alcohol and does the same thing comes in universities where children would actually challenge their own mates and say, "Tu vi pi ke dekhla." Problems jade zindagi de vicha they are like a washing machine, and we seem to be uh, they twist us, they spin us, they knock us out for six. Really, but the end of this problems jade pahar unde ya we come out cleaner, we come out squeakier, we come out more polished and refined because we see brightness at the end of that tunnel, and uh, things look better than before. So let's never be depressed. So like a washing machine, let's spin out, not let's not spin out into space forever, because these problems can really become a serious problem. Uh, Detox is a word which is very badly misconstrued in, in, in industry. Oh, do a seven day detox, do a four day detox. It doesn't happen. Your body is a, a capsule. In that capsule, we have 600 trillion cells. In that capsule, we have the eyes, the ears, the nose, the hearing capacity, the taste buds. We have the heart, the lungs, the pancreas, the gallbladder, the spleen, the kidney. Uh, we have the small colon. We have the large colon. We have the adrenal glands. And it's no, and the gallbladder. It's huge. And we have got 10 times more lymphatic system than arteries and veins put together. And in this eight quarts of blood, information is carried on. Lots of gandamand khaniyato, lots of things from jirilia sprays, pesticides, domestic pollution, uh, uh, power zones, lots of parbans, lots of chemicals, karande which jade sanu krab karene. So in my journey, I'll be taking you on to this show, which is called Detox. But what is Detox? It is misconstrued, and I hope that in this one hour you'll be able to make some sort of judgment ke what I'm talking about and what I mean in my clinic by detox. Mera show da sarin da nigga swagat. Honda mera show har sombar no vajke chali minute UK time. And asas ho raha ke USA, Canada de which we bahut loki dekh rahe and South America, Peru. Welcome. So a lot of people in South America are watching the show Sadaniga Swagat. In Spanish, I would say, uh, you know, um, it is, uh, uh, I don't know, what's the word in Spanish? I need to check this out. I've gone a bit foggy on that. OK, detox on a sensible note. Let's go on to this liver detox. So many different detoxes. So people are sending fad things. There's liver detox, electromagnetic field detox that I do in my clinic. Uh, there's a colon detox which I do. There's a stomach enzyme balance that I do. There's a gallbladder detox which I do. There is a urinary bladder detox which I do. There's a kidney stone detox, gallbladder detox. Now that is detox. If I give you a Hoover and I say ke quarter bag khali kar de, te Hoover kari ja, it's not going to pick up the garbage if the bag is not cleaned up properly and then you get a better pickup of all that garbage on the floor. The body has a great me uh, coping mechanism. It is so amazing. It can take so much bullshit, literally, I'm sorry about that word, uh, to get rid of it, its toxins naturally. But it can only be done with a sensible, healthy, balanced diet, good thoughts, good lifestyle, good exercise. So you can say maybe your friends to see naal brabar dauna da keso but your health demises because your body's mechanism 
coping mechanism has crashed out. They may carry on drinking. They might carry on donor kebabs. They might carry on having Radhe Baravaje the pizza. But your body cannot cope because that is full. You are now overloaded. You are now overflowing with all this information into your out of into the bloodstream, and now you've hit rock bottom. It's when you hit rock bottom, then people think, oh, you're depressed, oh, you're useless, oh, you'll have to give up work, and you start taking sick leave and time off work, or backache, or stomach problems. So all the therapies I do, they complement this word detoxification. It's a big word. Detox is D-E-T-O-X, a five-letter word. But what is detoxification? Uh, cleaning the rubble in the mind, body, and soul. Because if you don't clear this mind and you still got this baggage of the past of the mother-in-law, of the son, of the child or the husband, then you're not detoxifying. How to do it with a NAS scan? Come and see me. I'll take you to an amazing journey of knowing what really is detox. And then, you know, patients start healing. It's as if when the vacuum bag is clean and then we're picking up all the other residue and all the toxins and assisting the body to get rid of these um, things that have piled up in the system, which is now an overload. Gadivich pure fuel paria, you'll use the best fuel. You won't use leaded fuel in a diesel. Vice versa, you won't use diesel in a leaded because you don't conk it out. So why do we try to load up the wrong foods in the system and expect the best mileage? We want to put the right fuel to get the best mileage. We need the right tires. We need to get our car MOT. We need to get the oil. We need to get the water checked. We need to put antifreeze. But that is a mode of your travel. This body is your mode. It's your mode of your physical being on this earth, which Vaiguru has given you this blessed body. You are the caretaker. These pillars, these two legs are supporting the whole body. But any one point you have any information which is incorrect, your body is going to tilt. Or you might start walking wonky. Or you might get slacky. Or you might have kamardard. Or you might start limping. Or young children having knee aches. And young girls, another topic I'll be taking you, that in another 10 years, young girls are going to show osteoporosis, a bone disease. A serious problem coming through fizzy drinks phosphoric acids and coming through these fad bad diets that girls think by crash dieting and trying to keep their body down to in uh, you know eight stones and eating uh, picking up on sweets and white bread missing out desi food i may not look desi but i'm very desi in blood and my blood group is desi by the way it's not a or b or o i have got desi and ghee positive is my blood group. Welcome to the show. <laughs> I have to keep a bit of humor, but that's the reality. So I brought my children up on desi food, and they've grown up to be six foot plus, six foot three, six foot two, uh, carried on with sports and martial arts, and uh, uh, Dan one, Dan two, martial arts, swimming, uh, snorkeling, um, and just carried on working with them and giving them the sakya of Punjabi Gurbani and. A mother is an information carrier, but if she can't share that with her children and she can't motivate her children from the age of 2 to 18, uh, and then really primary from the age of 6 to 18, talking when the child can hold this information, a child can learn four languages at a time. At a time. That's the intelligence of a child. That's the intelligence of the sharpness of a child. But do we exploit this? Do we assist this? We say, Ni sada bacha Punjabi ni bolda because English art can take school and so Punjabi bol ni sakda. But a child can learn four languages, folks. Where have we gone wrong that we are losing our children from our mother tongue and not connecting with our children with our Sikh history and our food? Why are we westernizing ourselves? This detox word coming from mothers is wrong. You need to produce healthy children. You need to make a good diet. We've had callers calling to say that they changed their lifestyle and giving the children raw food, not opening processed dabbe and fast foods. And the children have shown less behavior problems, sleeping better, happier, less cranky, not too funny, sitting in one place, concentrating, not being a nuisance while a mother is driving. They are calmer. From here to Birmingham, mothers have driven with the most peaceful journey, having had the NEST program and detoxifying the garbage in the child from my program. Mira Clinic, the number I got 7886 Email ID 
Manjeet Kaur, 51 at yahoo.co.uk. My shop online is sales at manjeetshop.co.uk. You can see lots of my shows going back from the last 10 years on YouTube, lots of cook shows, lots of chat shows, everything to help you to feel the confidence that I, with my genuity, with my sincerity, I actually explore and assist my patients to come out through crippling diseases, but with His grace. Akal Puruk di nazar achi owe, te bohat dayaya, and I'm very grateful. Never start my day without thanking God. Never start my day without my meditation. Never start my day by making a humble request to my Akal Puruk, ke jeda vi patient awe, may my vision be open, and may I give my best service to the citizens that come to see me. That is the truth of my treatments. The patients, uh, you know, start healing much better. Their responses are much better. Some might take days, some might take a few weeks, some take three weeks. People come with heartburns, people come with burning, people come with having to save themselves from surgery of colon, colitis, bleeding colons, traveling from all over the world. I need to thank them uh, for having trust and faith. But our trust and faith overnight ni hunda. Our trust and faith builds up over time. I have got a caller on air. Let me now take this call and uh, the topic of discussion is detox. Hello caller, welcome and uh, a very warm good evening to my live show. What would you like to say? Hi Manjeet. Oh hi, how are you? I'm good thank you, how are you? Oh, 